All right, happy Leo season, August 1st. This goes out to all the Geminis out there. Uh, this is my prediction for you for the month of August. So let's see what's in store for y'all. Alright, pretty powerful vibes already. When I see the Daughter of Wands, the Son of Cups, and the Son of Swords, you're going to go through a lot this month. Not necessarily in a bad way, but your thoughts, emotions, and your actions will all undergo, undergo great trials this month. So you'll need a strong mind, a strong body, and a strong will to make it through what's in store for you. So protect your thoughts and ideas. Uh, don't let others sway you or drop you off your path if you've been working on a project for a few months or you've been um, an artistic type lately. Don't let other people drag you down or uh, stray you from your path. Uh, you're on your way, you need to keep going. Um, Son of Cups, a lot of good emotions for you this month. Um, try to relax with some friends on the weekends. Uh, don't work too hard. Keep your emotions high. Uh, keep, you, keep that communication flowing. And don't stop doing when, when you're not relaxing on the weekends. Uh, give yourself some very productive weeks and you'll see a lot of good things happen for you. Um, do not doubt do not doubt your talents and abilities. Uh, do not let the world get you down. Kind of uh, dive head first into anything that you've um, been working on. Um, these three are, are very excellent for you. Two of Cups uh, means a new partner. If you're single, um, you might find a new romantic interest. But this can also mean uh, platonic, platonic interests are coming to your life as well. So um, be on the lookout for that. Be open to new people. Be open to anyone who comes uh, approaching you and talking to you uh, with good intentions. Uh, Ten of Pentacles, very good card for your um, home life. Uh, you will have a very balanced and happy home this month. Again, this comes from staying on your path in all of your projects and keeping that communication flowing. Uh, there will be a lot of harmony at home this month. There will be a lot of harmony in your material world. Um, I don't see anything bad happening to your possessions or valued goods. And then ultimately, judgment. So karma will have a role this month. Keep your good karma high. Um, if you've been deceiving people or taking advantage of people, that will come back to haunt you this month. But if you've been a good person with good intentions, nothing but good will happen for you this month as well. So I see this as a very well-balanced reading for you. Um, stay on your path. Um, be open to new people. Uh, you'll have a lot of harmony at home. And if you're a good person, keep on keeping on because good things will happen to you. But if you've been bad... Um, What's been coming to you will come to you, so be on the watch out for that. And don't be a bad person, just be a good person, come on. So I hope you enjoyed. Uh, leave a comment if that resonates for you, and I'll see you in the next video. This is Brandon from Viking Tarot. I hope you enjoy the August predictions I have for you. And if you want to know more about me or what I do, check the description of this video, and I'll see you again soon.